Hey guys. Uh, just jumping on real quick this morning. Try to get the uh, Maxwell trial done before I head to work. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to try on my main account for now. Uh, let's check out the plan here. So uh, I think I'm going to go with the physical team. Uh, definitely want COD and Cloud of Darkness and Cecil. I uh, just finished my Rising Sun last night, so Cloud of Darkness is hitting pretty hard. Um, Cecil, we're actually going to give uh, Diabolos because uh, he already has 100% uh, Holy Resist. And that's actually why we're taking Cloud of Darkness for sure as well, because she has 50. Um, so we're hoping to evoke. Uh, actually, let's. Let's just actually just swap them here. Um, we're hoping to evoke the Abolus in there because that's how you unlock Maxwell. You have to evoke him and kill her. Um, so aside from that, uh, we're gonna want Refia in here. So one sec. And who else do we want? Um, yeah, I don't have a full breaker in here yet, so we're going to grab uh, the studio. Angus isn't leveled up high enough yet. And for our last person, probably Bart's, and I think we're going to get Bart's Killer Bow. Um, or maybe the studio will just rock it. Um, Yeah. They have about the same uh the same attack right now. It's probably no, that was good. Actually let's swap these two. Let's swap Okay, let's swap these two. And then yeah. Alright, so what do we have equipped right now? Blood sword. And then we've got um, let's, uh, let me just bring up the uh, stats on Maxwell here, so we know what we're doing. It looks like Maxwell has ah, uh, damn her. Uh, Okay, yeah, she has, she has no elemental resist. So, maybe we should actually stack fire weapons. I don't think it makes a difference, really. But yeah, let's try it. Yeah, and we don't want to use Excalibur, because Maxwell has, uh... has holy resist, so unfortunately we can't use that. Um... Yeah, killer bow for sure there. But it, yeah, it'd be nice to give. Be nice to give Bart and Cecil the same element weapon. I'm gonna check real quick if I have enough camera to buy the sword from the uh, from the event. How much camera do I have right now? Uh, I'm a little short. All right, whatever. We'll just go on with this. Um, I have a feeling my COD's going to do quite a bit of work here, so... Um, let's just double check our equips, though. Let's see, that looks good. That should be fine. Yeah, I won't need Bio Blaster. Still the other Guardian's Authority on here, unless it's not, it might be on Cecil. Uh, maybe I'll own one of them actually. Alright. Um. Some more HP. Lena doesn't need that, she's not coming.
Unfortunately, there's no like fire, uh, fire holy magic damage. So or fire light. We don't have any killer passives or anything we can use. So there's not a whole lot to take in here um, in terms of ability materials. a cod with five five thirty attacks so um yeah let's try this out this should this should work alright uh, I don't think we need jeweled ring it's probably something better we can throw on here maybe even a uh Hero ring here in case we're attacking. And you get more muscle belts. Alright, let's just try this out and see what happens. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna win the first time we fight her. Because to be honest, I haven't really looked that much into the into the fight, so I just know about the elemental resist. So yeah, we want to defeat with a limit burst, evoke Diablos during the fight, and clear without anyone dying. So, let's give this a shot. Um, we also know she's human, so anyone with Man Eater is great to have. Though, I'm hesitant to take in um, an Elza with Diabolos, just because she's likely to get uh, killed quickly. Then again, I don't have a ton of other options here. Um, this Lunath looks like it'll probably do some work. So 775 attack, so let's let's take him in. His cut through will definitely crush, so. Alright, let's try this out. So I'm pretty sure she has a million HP. So I'm gonna start off a little defensively. I'm gonna start off with uh, Arm Shot. And Embolden, of course. I'll also use focus because I think she does a lot of magic damage. Actually, I'm not sure about that. She might not do magic damage. Um, one sec. Yeah, there's really no info I can find right now. Easily. So, um, yeah, we'll just use focus. It can't hurt. And then we'll attack with everybody else. Pretty sure, yeah. Alright. Oh yeah, I'm gonna throw up Omni Veil too, actually. Actually, yeah, where I'm throwing up Omni Veil, I'm not gonna throw up Focus. Alright, let's do something like this. Okay, so it's not bad. Getting some damage in there. Oh yeah, I forgot my Cloud of Darkness isn't attacking either, so that's that's where a bunch of the, the damage is missing here. Alright, so she's doing Genesis, which is being mostly resisted. But it does lower my attack damage, so that'll probably be noticeable next turn. And back over to us, so that wasn't bad. Um Let's get an imperil up on her. And then everyone will attack. We'll just attack and we'll attack again. And we're going to throw up a uh, lag shot this time. Oh, wow, yeah. So, that Lunas is doing a lot of damage, but uh, Cod's doing work in there too. So now we're kind of at the point where we're not very close to summoning, so we kind of need to slow it down a little bit. Uh, I'm pretty sure she has a trigger at 30% maybe. So we don't really want to go that far until we're ready to summon. Then we can just finish her off the next turn. 
Alright, here comes Meteor. This could probably hurt. I don't know what the little damage happening is. Oh, maybe it's the little damage meteor? I didn't notice a meteor hit. Okay. Yeah, this doesn't seem too bad, guys. Um, let's cure everyone up all the way. And we're going to have to auto-attack because we want to kill her with a limit burst. And we also want to evoke Diabolos. We haven't done any of those things yet, so... Um, I'm just going to auto here. Even that's doing a lot of damage. Okay, this is actually good. She's healing up a bit because we're not really ready to kill her. I think our buffs are going to fall off this turn, so... Um, yeah. So let's throw Omni Veil back up. And what else did we lose? I think that's it, actually. And uh, we'll heal up again. Grind some LB crystals. I almost don't want to talk, attack Lunith just because I'm worried about Lunith. Uh, no, she's, Lunith won't kill her this turn, but I'm worried about him doing too much damage. Because I'm really not close to summoning my Asper yet. Omni Veil's a must. This would have killed everybody. It's still gonna kill the studio parts. Wow. Okay, so this move's called Endless and it's definitely a lot of damage. Ah, uh, it's full life. Studio. And uh, we'll let him break here. No, shit, we kind of need to heal. Uh, we'll let him break. We'll need this guy's. Alright, um. Yeah, we're not gonna get the dark resist. Yet. Healing back up again. Man, the Esper thing goes so slowly. Someone else is down. Okay. So we've got a. We've got a limit break ready that we kill her with. But that won't get us Maxwell, which is what we really want. I'd like to get both done for some in here, and then I'm, I can come back for the Dark Resist one. That's not a big deal. But, uh. Yeah, let's keep holding off. I actually defend with a limit here because I don't want him to die. Try to keep people up once they go down because they lose all their buffs. May just have to end this. Oh, let's try to get on parts this time. Two limit breaks now. And a 
meteor coming though. Live Lunith. Man, our Esper got I know we I know we've been really defensive, but our Esper gauge really hasn't moved. Um What we really need, we need to get Mustadio up so he can um I need to get the attack break up on her. Playing really dangerously here. Especially where I don't really know her moves. Wow. Clattering just got one shot. We're from fall. Okay, we need to try to end this now. Um, oh, she buffed herself, that's why. Yeah, boost attack. Alright. Uh, we'll do a leg shot, and then hopefully Lilith can finish her off with a. Uh, Here. Nope. Okay. So we win. That's alright. It doesn't seem like that difficult. It's just that we were trying to get the Esper gauge up and it never happened. Uh, so I think we'll just auto attack from the start because we kind of got her down so far that we had to wait. Um. Maybe taking in a, a, a max will be worth it. We definitely need someone with dual wield who will help us uh, build up our, our Asper gauge. So let's, let's try to find a COD with dual wield. Here we go. So this is basically the exact same COD as what I have. So two of these be pretty strong. Then I'll have two Omni Veils. Yeah, it should work out well. What's up, Joe Toto? How's it going? Have you done this yet? Alright, so again, start with Omni Veil. Bolden. Arm Shot. And then everyone will auto. Need some Esper Crystals. We got one. And just one. Okay, we got one Esper Crystal. Genesis. I think as long as we keep an uh, uh, Omni Veil, we should be alright here. Got no full break. Do you have Mustadio at least? Because he's got because he's got the two breaks. That's what I'm using him for. I don't know. I don't have full break either. I have an Ingus, but I don't have him leveled up yet. Oh yeah, I'm going to put up in peril there. Ah, that's alright. We're in no rush. Got another Esper Crystal. Can we get some more? And uh, also using the studio with the Killer Bow which is working out pretty well. Uh, man, I hope Barts doesn't go down here. Live Barts. I'm the Veil again because otherwise Bart's going to be dead next turn. Hey Shinwire, how's it going? Uh, Elder Break's probably good enough, but it's it's nice to have the attack break as well. Uh, so that's why I'm using the studio, but yeah, that's the problem. It can... Um, Not allowing the attack and, and magic will have you d taking a lot more damage.
None so far. There's one. We got one. There's two. By Genesis. So that's not bad. I know we just got our uh, I know we just got a attack debuff, but I'm not looking too bad here. Um There's no real way to get rid of the uh, the attack debuff, eh? Alright, let's throw Imperil up. And we'll rapid fire. And barrage. And then what else to do what they just did? Actual we'll madness rush with her. Actually, we'll feel like Slash, because I know she can take poison she can get diseased as well, so getting her disease seems worth it. It's another 10% off her, um, her defense. Okay, so we're doing damage now. Cloud of Darkness is throwing up 20k on the, uh, on the barrages, so there's eight of them. 22k. Alright, this is looking pretty good. We're pretty close to getting our Esper. So we're back to kind of the first time where we have her down really far. We just need to make sure we don't kill her too early. Oh god, Raphael, live. No, Raphael's down. Alright, that's alright. We're just going for the Diabolo summon, so... It's alright if we lose a person. We can come back for the other trials later. Like, I, I could easily beat this without going for the summon. Um, maybe we'll get her back up, actually. Yeah. We got lots of Phoenix Downs. I am worried that she'll die again right away because she doesn't have any buffs, but... Let's, let's refresh Omni Veil, I guess. And I'm going to switch to auto attacks. I don't want to kill her before we get that Esper off. I feel like Cecil hasn't blocked any of these attacks. Good news is this is when it breaks up. Get everyone buffed up here. I should have waited for that to go off before I before I healed. Would have got a bit of extra from the spirit. Uh, okay, I get, still have all the debuffs up on her. So let's just auto attack here. Oh, we just got a bunch of Asper shards. We, we didn't get enough. We need a few more. Hopefully she just keeps healing if I get her low. No. She's endless, which is a pretty big attack. Don't think everyone's going to live here. Okay, yeah, that's kind of what happened last time I was here. I was just waiting for Esper. Okay. Heal up. Try to get Miss Thaddeo up. So we need to get Arm Break back up. Yeah, she does a crazy amount of damage. Um, and Elz is just going to use the Automatically Revive. Something goes down here. 
Cecil with the block finally. Uh, live. Alright, here we go. This is looking good again. Oh. I can't really auto attack her. I'm gonna I'm gonna kill her if I auto attack her, so. I'm not 100% sure what to be doing here. Definitely get arm breakout, arm shot. Yeah, I might. Yeah, I might need to bring a radio just to get the um, the increased uh, summoning thing. It'll do like less damage. <laughs> um, but it'll still let me generate crystals. I don't know, we'll see. This might kill her. Oh man, we're so close to the Esper. I need her to heal up. But she keeps attacking. If I get really low here, I'll just finish her off with Elza's Loom Break, and then um, I'll at least finish off that part of the, the mission so I don't have to worry about that next time I'm here. Alright, instead is the least damage. Let, let's rapid fire with him to start, see if we can get one more crystal here. What? Did I not just hit rapid fire? Oh yeah, I guess you can only wrap you can just wrap a fire once. Yeah. Um Here we go. Oh, oh I shouldn't have okay. So we just need to survive a turn and we got this. Survive a turn and we'll summon and then we'll do a uh I'll have a break to kill her. Alright, we got this guys. Uh she probably does have a pattern. I haven't been paying attention to be honest. Alright, here we go. So summon him and then kill her with this. We did it, guys. Now, hopefully, the missions actually trigger properly. I hope they got the killing blow with the, with the limit break. I should have paid more. I should have only attacked with the limit break. All right, so we got the trust Moogle. And yeah, sweet. We got it. Awesome, guys. So I'm just going to go back and I'll do this later, but uh, I need to go to work, unfortunately. Uh, appreciate everyone watching, and hopefully it helps you guys out with your fights. Uh, I will go back in, and I'll, I know a few people wanted uh, my COD for their friends list, so uh, Joe Toto, I'll go add you, and uh, if anyone else needs my Cloud of Darkness, let me know, and um, I'll get you added. Alright, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Uh, have a good day. I'm, I'll probably be on this afternoon. So I'll catch you later.